Who is that? Who is that, YouTube? Oh, look who it is. Why do you have on a hat? Uh -huh. Look who it is, YouTube. You got someone you know. I'm sick of you. She's finally back. My twin. Storm looks like him. You two, drop a comment below and tell me if she looks like me so we can end this debate once for all. YouTube, it don't matter, you two. Tell me if she look like me. You look like without me. hair on her face. You look like the to YouTube, YouTube, drop a comment below and let me know. What is storm, guys? Drop a comment below if you see him. I guess the AC was broke on the bus, guys. This is this is too crazy, guys. What's up? How you doing? Man, what's up, man? Well, y'all didn't get stuck out there. Y'all made it back from France. Hey. Y'all check it out, guys. <laughs> Storm, what's up? Go get your bag, man. Look over there. Look, 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 look. Go see your sister. Look at her. All right, let's go to cheesecake. Lucy does Just put a little extra on it. Here, pour what you want on it. Pour what you want on it. And then I'll put it All right, YouTube, it's the next day, man. Today is Monday. I don't know the day, man. Hey, man, we had a good time last night. I did some buzzard stuff last night, man. Uh, I left my daughter at the gas station after I got gas. She was inside the gas station. I just drove off. Um, my son, I didn't know until my son said something. Uh, I had left my credit card at Cheesecake Factory. And I was called Cheesecake. I said, hey, did you guys have a car? And they were like, yes, we do. I never knew she got out the car because I was just... I put the pump back and I walked back around and drove off. I told my son to get back in the car because he was getting ready to get out to go in the store. I didn't know she had already went in the store. So we leaving the gas station and I'm, I'm rushing to get on the highway. I see my phone, my dog come. I say, Serena, why are you calling me? I'm thinking she's behind me. 
I said, Serena, why you called me for? I look back. She was gone. I say, oh, snap, I done left my daughter in the gas station. And she was coming like, you left me, you left me. So I had to go back, turn the car around, go back and get her out the gas station, man. That was pretty funny. And I ended up going back and picking her up and went back and got my credit card. So I picked my daughter up that I left, and I went back and put my credit card that I left. So that was that was pretty, <laughs> that was a pretty good one. All right, so now, you YouTube, we have to go get a license plate for our power wash trailer. Only dilemma is in Palm Beach County, you have to be a Palm Beach resident. I am not one, so you cannot go to any of the tax collector's office to get the tax. So you got to go to another county. So I called Broward and I called Martin County. And Martin County said I can come up there and get the tag. So now we're going to head up there to get the tag. Then we're going to go to Kiki's and get some brunch. So let's go get this tag. Martin County. Oh yeah, right next to Port St. Lucie. So now we gotta get off and get to the DMV. We are nine minutes away. Alright guys, hopefully the line isn't too long. You can come to Martin County and get a tag no matter what county you're from in florida but you cannot get this in palm beach county they only do residents only in palm beach probably because it's too populated let's go ahead and get this tag all right that was quick man we got our tag for the trailer let's get out of here and get these kids something to eat Alright guys, and we at our favorite spot. Look what he always getting. Rennie's getting a buffalo chicken wrap. I said I'm stuck between a chocolate chip waffle. You two drop a comment below. Should she get a, a chocolate chip waffle or a buffalo chicken wrap? Drop a comment below. Let us know in the comments. I'm getting the apple cinnamon stuffed French toast with scrambled eggs with cheese and bacon. Nuke D said he wants chicken strips and fries or a waffle. But he wants to go to Raisin Cane's, guys. Who else eat Raisin Cane's? That's all he wants. We're going to go there for dinner tonight. All right, guys, we we had brunch. We went and checked on our Pride Wash trailer. We are at Harbor Freight, man. Getting some stuff we need just for the new trailer, man, because I like to have two of everything, the stuff I already got. I don't want to be moving from house to house, so I'm going to keep everything down here and just get all new stuff just because I got to change the tire. Man, this is a 50-foot hose. I think I'm going to go ahead and get a 100-foot hose. I got little gun cases and stuff. Mm. Get a hundred foot holes. Oh yeah, get this one. I always get the garden holes when we get the This one's forty dollars. Go ahead and get that man. Get some ratchet straps to get up out of here. We got all that stuff, man. For 180 at Harbor Freight. Got a commercial grade hose reel. Got a two-ton jack. Since I'm driving this trailer back to the other home, I want to have everything I need just in case I have a breakdown or a tire blowout. So rather than rather than you know using my roadside and having to wait three or four hours, I'll take stuff into my own hands. And I got a whole kit to change the tire, trailer tire, if I got to. So that's that's what we doing. All right, guys. So you seen how my day went a little bit. We hung out. I got my kids back yesterday. We went out to eat. Um, I left my kid at the store. 
Lost my credit card last night, but got it back. Shot the Cheesecake Factory Palm Beach Gardens. And today we ran around and got our side business, you know, a lot of stuff squared away and ironed out. We got our license plate. Um, we got our trailer pretty much done. We're going to pick that up tomorrow. We're going to go swap the rental car, get a pickup truck. And then we'll, head, we'll take it back home Wednesday evening back to the house and we'll have a trailer at the other spot. So now, you know, that'll create another stream of income that you could do on the side. You know, you got to put yourself in position. Like I always tell y'all, it take money to make money. So that's what we doing, man. But, uh, yeah, I appreciate y'all for going out about with us today. Uh, Storm over there working on the project. We probably gonna head to raising canes for dinner. I probably will grab me a t-shirt or something from Cole. I need a Nike shirt, and um, that'll be it. Tomorrow we pick up the trailer. Uh, they back. He goes back to school tomorrow. My daughter's on spring break because she goes to school in Ohio. Uh, high school up there. So we'll take him to school, we'll hit the gym, we'll pick up the trailer tomorrow, we'll go right along with me with that, on that ride, and that'll be this another day. And we might do a company review tomorrow, so yeah, man, this is the message from today's video, man. Do not leave your kid at the store. Slow down, take a deep breath, analyze what's going on, man. Um, I also want to say another thing, man. I got a lot of people in the comments uh, asking me, um, hey man, do you work at these companies? I'm gonna put you down as a referral, this and that. Hey, listen, all I do is company reviews, guys. I do not work at none of these companies. Um, you know, a lot of guys, you guys come across my videos on YouTube when it's a little bit of confusion. I do not work there, but if you want to put me down as a referral, maybe they should pay me because I'm referring their company, I'm reviewing their company. And, Getting them traffic and traction to their company. Hey, you companies out there that I don't review, get in with me. You know, we can work something out, man. I could be an influencer, do a video drop for you guys or whatever, man. But that's all, man. I appreciate y'all. And it was something else, man. Somebody else said something to me, man. What else is it, man? Oh, uh, if you guys need help finding a class... For to forget any of your endorsements for CDL, um, some of your endorsements require prerequisites, or you just want to study. Um, hit me up. My email's in the description below. I can help you, guide you through it. If you're a Florida or a Texas resident, Louisiana, help me up. Hit me up. I can help you with the uh, uh, with the with the navigation, doing all that stuff. On um, you, pretty much. Uh, yeah. Once you get your hazmat, uh, you pay for a new driver's license. They're gonna give you one. With just the tanker and doubles and triples endorsements, and then once the feds approve your background, they're gonna mail you another copy of your driver license with the X on it. If you have, if you do get the hazmat endorsement, um, I did a video a while back about the Twit card. Go back in my catalog and look for it. Um, as far as the passenger endorsement go, you can't just go take a test for that. That's the only endorsement you got to go back and do practical training for it at your CDL school that you went to. So as far as the passenger endorsement go, I don't I don't really need that. I'm not gonna be driving passengers around. That's not my cup of tea. Shop the Greyhound drivers. Um what else we had to talk about, man? Um it was something else. It was something else you guys asked me about. Um oh but other than that man I appreciate y'all man I see a lot of guys saying, you know, I'm motivation for them. They like how I'm living. They, they like the full family thing. I'm just doing the natural, bro. I'm not doing nothing extra. This is just my daily life, man. On the go, hanging with the family, you know, just stuff like that, man. Um, but uh, all my truck drivers out there that's looking to do side businesses, make sure you get all your stuff right. Get your LLC in order. Get your sun biz. They just came out that new law where you got like declare it like your LLC. I'm still trying to figure out what it's called. Like if you don't report it, they're gonna charge you like a fine. You got to the end of the year to do it. Um, you have to do it for every LLC in your name. So make sure that you guys are on top of that new law. And no matter what state you're in, it's the same thing. And uh, make sure you do your guys' annual report to keep your LLCs active. So that's another big thing I got to do personally. Um, May got to make some of them inactive, but I got to renew some and I got to create a new one for the new hustle because 
the old pressure cleaning company I had has been dormant for so long, but this is the new one. I'm going to do that and uh, have all my ducks in a row, man. And then uh, I'll probably do a video on how to get small business insurance on the go. So uh, back back 10 years ago, that wasn't around, but now you can get it at the drop of a dime on your phone. So I'll probably do a video on how to sign up for business insurance for certain jobs that you may end up encountering and having to do. And the HOAs may want you to have proof of insurance. So, but that's all, man. I appreciate y'all for rocking me today, going along. And I'll see y'all tomorrow on the next one.